Just a little video of the ins and outs of my room. It's quite K-pop based, so if you don't like K-pop, not entirely sure why you clicked on this channel. That it's clearly about K-pop. <laughs> I hope you like it though, and maybe it inspires you to look at some. That would be fun. But this is just a little tour, so I'll speak you through all of the little things, like my poster wall. Very exciting very large collection of posters you've got there. Wow. And then there's my little, it's quite artsy as well because I am an art student. So first off we have my little shelving unit. It's just some shelves. It's a different colour to the whole of my room. It's grey instead of white but we love them nonetheless. There's me showing off my albums. I've got quite a few. As you can see just here, I'm dancing to La 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 by April. <laughs> this here is my TWICE collection. So I've got my little binder at the end and then also all of my TWICE albums, which is not complete yet. And then I have my other girl group albums, apart from From Is Nine, you'll see that later. Ooh. And then also I have my like manga collection, which is a lot of like stuff. And also Grape Fanta, because of oh, Melon Fanta, I mean, I'm sorry. And here's my fandom collections, so they're just books that I quite like to display off. And down here is my books that I read. I usually go to the library though, so there's a lot of books that I do read that aren't here. And here is my Promise Nine collection on top of my desk. Very proud, beautiful stuff. And here's the area of my desk that you usually see, which is when I'm filming, because it's the only clear space in my room. And then here's my Moshi Monster trading cards. I just really like those ones. And a little pan on my desk. I've got little homemade from S9 and Twice pins. And then also my kind of like collection of tiny things. I've got Sims 2 pets, a whole bunch of hair buns. And then all my notebooks and cards for trading, and a little boss, the shark, full hand cream that I can't use because my hands are allergic to it. And just to prove that this is actually real, I left all my clothes on my chair, and an empty whisper bar in the bin. And once again proving this is real, there's just all of my textiles coursework in a big old pile. Now switching it up a little bit, here's all my plushies on my bed very cute. I've got also a blanket that I won in a reddit giveaway that has from his nine on it and my heart eyes cushion and Oberon the shark. As you can see Hitomi is on the back of this cushion but I don't generally display it because I don't want to scare people off any more than I already have. And then just above my head is just a couple of postcards to remind me who I really love. And a tea box that is covering wires that could potentially electrocute me. Here once again, proving that this is very unplanned. There is a lovely piece of thread in one of my plants. Here, where all my plants are, is my bedside table, which I don't really use for much other than plants, tiny things, and some cute decorations. Once again, continue with the theme of cute decorations. Here's my other shelf, which just has a lot of cute things on it. 
like this tiny windmill I got in Jeonju and a tiny house very tiny, very small and I made it all myself but the light doesn't work because the battery ran out mm. this here is just my little chest of drawers I think you could call it where I keep all my fabrics and costumes this one is not done big sad I also apparently can't shut drawers and this here is just my little wall of paintings and photos and stuff a little scrap wall club penguin k-pop women's and other random artsy stuff and last but not least we have my little card dog he doesn't have a name he's just very cute though and that concludes my little room tour there's me wearing two different pyjamas. Thank you so much for watching. Here's a cute clip of Sawyer as a thank you. Bye bye.